What's up, everybody? Welcome back. Another episode, Russian River. Gotta love it. I can't get enough of this river, especially in the late summer. Seems to be when the bass are the most active and they just want to eat. Anything you throw out, you're probably going to get bit. So, we got maybe, maybe about an hour and a half or so to fish. I'm going to work the banks, find those deep holes. Got myself a... Uh, crawdad imitation crawdad crankbait whatever you want to call it and i also have the old trusty ned rig so can't go wrong with those i'll start with them see what happens if nothing happens obviously you guys know how it works kind of work through the baits figure out the pattern the technique see if we can't get bit let's go Try this little pocket right here. Let's see if there's anybody home. Yep. Oh, almost. Let's give him a few more seconds to eat it. I see him swiping at it. He got it. Cool. It's a baby, baby. It's so cool watching them, watching them come up and you know come out of these trees, and they're still pretty aggressive too. So they're fighting over it. It's so awesome. definitely in here. I bet you there's a bigger one in there too. Just needs to come out and play. It'll come from the back here. Oh, get it. If I had more time, I would. Oh, got him. Oh, dang it. I was just going to say, if I had more time, I would spend a little more. Oh, you just hit it. You got it? You got it? Yep, you got it. Oh. Oh. What in the world, man? Come on. Just want to catch some fish. Come back out, guys. Oh, oh, you got it. What do you think, puppy? What do you think? Oh, it's a beautiful smallmouth. Look how beautiful this guy is. Gorgeous colors. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Okay. All right. He was ready to go. He was like, I'm out. Can't stay for photos. A pocket right here. Maybe there's something in here. Oh, oh, got it. It just blows me away. I mean, we're inches of water and it just, there's still fish. It just blows me away. I say that every time I come out here, but it's just crazy what these fish live in and what they're capable of doing in such shallow water. Not only are they living, they're thriving. A little honey hole right here, they're exactly, you know, they're waiting for a bait to come down and they come out and grab it and they're on their way. Oh, 
some girl. Get this pocket a little bit more. See if I can't get at least one decent one out of here, and then I am off. Off to the next one. I, only, I probably only have about, I'd say, 30 minutes left of daylight, so I gotta be moving here pretty quickly. I don't mind a little walking in the dark. You know, that doesn't bother me much, but when I have my dog with me. You know, take an extra precaution. Coyotes, mountain lions, rattlesnakes, you know. All the harmful things that my dog probably would not do well with. Carrot. Hard for me to believe there's there's one. Got him. I was literally just about to say, I'm like, there's it's hard to believe there's not more up in those trees. Oh. Quick release. Again. Nothing. A little disappointing. Totally was not filming. Didn't think I'd actually catch one. Bike minnow. Woo. Slimy booger. Never know what you're gonna get. I was just on my way walking back towards the where I parked. And uh yeah, okay, throw back in here. Sure enough. Hey come here. Come here. Come here. Time check. No idea. Well, I do know the sun's gonna be going down here in about, I'd say I probably have 20, but probably 20 minutes now. So, I'm gonna start kind of hauling butt back to the truck. And uh, if I catch any more, if I get any more action, you guys will see it. Okay, the final send. This is pretty much the last piece of water that I'm gonna be fishing before, before I head back. Hey, hey, come here. Come here. So. That feels like a pike minnow. Yep. Pike minnow it is. Feel them thump it. Oh, there he is. Uh let's try it one more time. I love it when you can actually feel them pecking. Boom, boom, boom. There he is. 
That was quick. Oh my gosh, that's a dark, dark smally. Look at that. Gotta be smallest smallmouth I've caught out of here in a while. See you, buddy. I know there's big ones in here. I just don't know why they're not biting. There's another one, so I dropped it. Better one. Oh yeah, there we go. It, the way it bit it felt like a tiny one. That's actually a really nice one. Oh sweet. I'll take it. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Oh, I love smallmouth. a random tennis ball. My dog seems to like it. Go get it. One of the many random, random things that we do when we're out here on the river. One minute we're catching fish. One minute we're playing fetch. There you go. There you go. Go get it. There's random thing number two. It's like an old blazer. Hmm. Interesting. Been here for a long, long time. Wonder if maybe someone stole it and left it back here. Boom. Trying to do the stealth approach. Probably 20, 30 feet back. I'm just trying to cast up into these holes here. Hope to goodness I don't get caught. With it being so shallow, it's hard. You gotta you gotta be a little more skillful with where you're casting and what you look like to them because they can see if you if you can see them they can definitely see you and they probably see you way way before you see them for sure so i'm trying a different approach here oh another bite Oh my gosh.
All right, fish number two. Same little pocket. Well, was not even trying to fish and I caught another smallmouth. What the heck? Ooh, crazy, crazy. Sun's going down. Dog and I are gonna head back to the truck. What a wild day. I mean, what, hour and a half maybe? We had the fish. Weather's changing, water's still dropping. Like I said earlier, I haven't been out here for a couple of weeks. Maybe even more, actually. Can't remember. But, you know, the water's dropped significantly since even I was out here, whenever the last time that was. So, I know the, the habits of the fish are changing. That cooler weather's coming in. We had a little bit of rain last week. So, come on, come on. So it's just, you know, trying to figure it out and I'm just happy I got into a few. Got a few smallmouth, a couple pike minnow, and uh, although most of the smallmouth were, were tiny, I did get one nice one. So I'll take it. I will absolutely take that. And uh, a decent pike minnow. So who, who knew, who knew, you know? So i make my way back to the truck before the sun goes down. And I will catch you guys on the next one. Take care. Peace.